Well, if you've been watching any of my videos, you know what my creek looks like. It's nice, tranquil, small pools, not much going on, kind of a trickle. But last night things have changed. I got over seven inches of rain over a course of about four hours. And I say over seven because that is as high as my rain gauges go. So I have no idea how much we really got past that. But going to go check my crawfish traps this morning and I was met with a very different sight. So I'm going to go ahead and show you that right now. I'm going to go down to the creek and turn this down and go through a path and show you how Mr. Hansler has just lost a couple hundred dollars worth of traps. Nice little path down here. And by now you ought to be hearing that sound of rushing water. It's already gone down about four or five foot, which is a good thing. But that's it calm. Five, six hours ago, there were actually trees coming down that. And that is my creek, my little trickle of a creek. Let's go back over here. If you watch the videos on cast nets, uh, umbrella nets, and things like that, a lot of them actually happen around this area. And so little bitty pools, places that uh, are surefire, surefire for catching crawdads, like this right here. I'm up on the bank, about seven, eight foot up on top. But that's where I usually put a lot of my crawfish traps, is right there. If you saw the how to throw a cast net video, I was standing about seven foot under the water right there. And all of my traps have washed all the way down. Now again, this water's gone way down. Uh, we couldn't even see that middle barrier earlier today. And it was a lot louder. I couldn't even hear the audio over the amount of water that was coming through here. But over the course of the next 24, 48 hours, the water should return to fairly normal. <laughs> or at least get into a place where it's manageable and I can get down there and around it. And we'll see if we can't find some of the crawfish traps and uh, observe some of the changes that have happened in the creek. Because it's not going to be the same. But the weather's changing. The rain looks like it's coming back. It's starting to sprinkle on me. It's already starting to darken, even in the lens of the camera. But, you know, Mother Nature. There's no controller some days.